Welcome back to my channel. I am back today with another video and today y'all I have another wig to do a review on. So today's wig is going to be on this one right here. This one is from Outre. This one is called Leela. I did get this one from EbonyLine.com so of course y'all already know what the deal is. I have to give them a huge shout out for sending me this wig. Thank you very much. It is highly and always appreciated. So y'all let's just get into what this wig is all about. Like I told y'all, this one is from Outre. The name of it is called Leela. I have it in the color number two. So other deets about this one is that it is pre-pluck, the lace parting that is, and we have natural baby hairs, and that's about it, y'all. So it's not much to this wig when it comes to details, but um, this is what she is looking like straight out of the bag. Very, very pretty, y'all. She looks like she's going to be a classic wig classic style anyway so um yeah this is a lot of lace y'all we have a lot of lace on this wig so um yeah it's a little tan i don't know i'm i'm, I'm sure i might have to go and tweak this color they didn't say anything about hd oh yes they did they did say hd lace y'all which um i'm pretty sure it's not gonna be hd on me because this is very very light and we can't heat this one up to 400 fahrenheit so yeah this one does have the one comb in the back with the two adjustable draw straps and two combs in the front. So I will go ahead and take this one off if y'all interested in this one. I will leave the link in the description box below for you to go ahead and check it out. Very, very pretty. And y'all, I've been wearing this one a lot lately. So anyway, y'all, I'll be right back with Leela on. Okay, y'all, and this is what she is looking like directly on my head. Nothing done to her. And y'all, I'm thinking she is going to be an easy easy sleep just like I like so so let me give y'all a close-up of what she is looking like up close and personal so of course that part in space is looking really really nice so I don't think we're gonna have to do much at all with this one just put the powder and we're good to go my head is 22 inches and she reaches way right here on that side of, so I guess I don't have a tilt it as much as I could but she's just about not quite almost ear to ear on me so yeah not too bad uh, just a little bit of my edges are peeping out on this side they didn't mention anything about pre plucation so we didn't get any y'all so um it might not be a problem anyway because of the style of this wig i'm definitely going to go in and use some of the baby hairs because i mean she looking a little circular around the hairline so definitely going to have to go in and make it look more realistic um this one is for my righties y'all so unfortunately for the lefties y'all i sport them regardless so it doesn't matter but i prefer the left side but yeah this one is for the righties so let's see if this one is big hair friendly y'all know how i do so yeah i know i got all this space on my forehead y'all i got a big forehead so this is the furthest i can pull it down y'all the furthest so i don't think it's like super big hair friendly in my opinion Big hair friendly means I can put it all the way around here, like right here. But I think it's associated with it. I don't think it's super small. I don't think, y'all. But sometimes I'm off. But yeah, I could pull it all the way back up here, y'all. So if your head is bigger than 23 inches, maybe you might have a problem. But anyway, that's just the way I judge if it's big hair friendly or not. But I'm going to go in and fix the lace and, of course, continue on watching. And we're going to talk about good, bad, and not so good at the end of the video.
Okay, y'all. So let's talk about Miss Leela. I'm feeling her, y'all. I am definitely feeling her. She is super, super cute. Like I thought, very classic style, making me look all sophisticated and stuff. So yes, I'm definitely here for Miss Leela. So let's talk about all the pros because I don't even really know if I have any cons for this one. Y'all know I, I have to make sure I give y'all all the cons. But anyway, let's just get into all the pros first and maybe I think of something at the end. So as for the pros, of course, the way she is feeling, this is a light yakky texture, y'all. So I'm definitely here for the yakky texture. Y'all know I like both. And Yaki is my favorite, and this one is very, very nice, very pretty. I haven't been getting any tangles at all, not one, y'all, out of this unit at all. And of course, the length is probably another pro to it because, you know, usually when you have a longer synthetic wig, even though some of them don't tangle a lot when it's yakky, this one with the length and the texture, I'm definitely feeling it because it's not tangling, and I haven't gotten any shedding from this one either. Nothing. So, three pros. Party space, like I told you, is perfect. Powder, and I was good to go. As for the density, I love the density. This is perfect, the density. It's not too thick and it's not too thin at all, so I'm loving that about this unit. As for the baby hairs, the baby hairs weren't too hard to put down. They could have been a little thinner, but yeah, not too bad at all. Really, y'all, I don't even know what to complain about because the style is cute too. We have a little, a small, little light, bang action right here which i like i'm feeling like michelle obama y'all like seriously in this hairstyle it's sophisticated and just smart but anyway y'all i don't even think i have any kind the only thing i can think of maybe i don't think it's super super big hair friendly because of you know earlier what i when i showed y'all you can only go about right here on my forehead but i think you may be able to get any y'all it's kind of hard for me to gauge sometimes because i can't wear most units but this one right here i think it might be big head associated i'm definitely here for this one if y'all like a classy cute style that's affordable good quality on this one y'all this is definitely one to pick up, so yes, I'm definitely feeling her. So anyway, y'all know my thoughts. I want to know yours. Let's have that conversation. Drop it in the comment section so we can continue talking. And I will see y'all in my next video, but do not forget to like, comment, and of course, subscribe. Now, I'm going to end this video. I will see y'all in my next one.